morning guys third day in a row that we're up and out of the house before nine but i need coffee otherwise i can't do anything so we came to a cafe because i saw they have fancy coffee good morning from Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Look at where we are. We are jumping on the forest train. I'm actually really excited. It's such a beautiful day, and we're going to check out a different part of Mishkolt, more like nature y. Like, who said Mishkolt doesn't have anything to do? We and, don't, I think we got to oh, go. Oh, we got to go, okay. This train, this train is like really rocky. You gotta like, I gotta hold on tight when I'm outside. The nice morning breeze in my face. It's like so bouncy. The guy, the uh, the guy that checks the tickets, he jumped between the trains as it was moving. The guy was crazy. He had hand tattoos. <laughs> and the the trains like. And it's it was, very scenic and r rickety. I think Felicia, you were sleeping the whole time. I'm tired. <laughs> but it's really pretty here. We're in Lila Fured. Guys, we just turned the corner and there's this huge waterfall. Our first waterfall in Europe, no? I think so. We did it, Val! We did it! Oh, that looks really pretty. Okay, let's get a better view. There's like two spots. So we're, we're in the we're in the mountains here on the east of Hungary. This is called like the it's a buck, buck, book, book mountains. The buck mountains, book mountains, buck mountains. And it's like, they got a lake, the, the waterfall, like, there's a lot of stuff. There's castles, this whole place looks like a castle. There's a statue here, his name's Attila, that's my dad's name. And like, everything looks like a castle and, I don't know. Felicia, thoughts? It's very pretty. Felicia gets mad at me uh, too often, I think. Why do you get mad at me so much, Phil? I think anybody who's seen us from the beginning might might be able to understand the frustrations of traveling with Wes. <laughs> I just stepped in a puddle. Oh, what is all of this? There's like little caves. Can we go in, do you think? I don't know. Your voice went so high. <laughs> I don't know. We could go right through. in Hungary. Who would have thought? It's an amazing view. We came to the other side of the lake to get a shot. This is this is what we've been waiting for. This shot of a of a something with reflecting on the water. The hotel. It's a hotel. This is gonna be on Instagram I think. We yeah. think this shot's gonna Check be on Instagram. out on Instagram. We're well, trying to get better at our photos here and our video true. and everything. We're trying to get better at everything. We just like learning. Yeah. Getting always improving, always learning. And we talked about this in Debrecen too. It's like it's not too late to learn something new. Yeah. So check oh, out. And I learned another thing. So I'm watching these tutorials and the guy says the word amateur in French comes from loving something, like lover of. Amateur, I don't know. Um amateur. And so it just it goes to show like if you're an amateur it doesn't mean like you're not a professional you're gonna be terrible at something it just means you really love something and if you really love something I think you always want to improve at it and I think that's kind of where we're at. Amateur. 
Look, I'm learning Hungarian. The first word to or to or something means lake and then kert, which I learned yesterday, means garden. And etterem is restaurant, right? Yeah. And panzio, I think it's like inn maybe? I'm not sure. Watch that part. Whoa! <laughs> Too close. Oh, there it is. Sa self a Santa, what? Self a Santa selfie. Photo bomb. Didn't we take a picture with Santa one year? Yeah. We were oh, like grown oh, up. Oh, Merry Christmas. So, Fel, we read the sign. The castle is a dangerous place. So I got to keep my eye on you. And they give like full on documentation of all the stuff. and But this is included with our card, so it's free. Yeah, that tourist pass is pretty good. Some things you just see on the internet, we look it up, we go on Wikipedia, we go on whatever website, Pinterest or Google Images, and we see something and like, yeah, okay, we'll go there. But then you get here and it's like actually good to see with your eyes. It's really impressive. Like this, even just the scale, like it, it's huge and we're just so tiny. Hey, speak for yourself. <laughs> Felicia's actually like four foot two. You guys, the video makes her, I, I edit her a little. I'm five, five and a half. <laughs> I'm six, three. What? Felicia, load the cannons! Was I supposed to say something? Yes, sir. Oh. Yes, sir. Those Hungarians make some steep stairs. We've been to a few castles, but this is the first one where I feel like we're walking through the grounds the way it would have been before. Because bef uh, some other castles, I feel like you just, it's like a museum. But this one feels like it's a bare castle and you're just walking through the grounds in a castle. I like this one. It's like this is technically still Mishkoltz. And it's like, Lot, like two years ago we came to Mishkoltz and we spent two days here. We thought we saw the city. But like the only way to really see a city is to spend time in it. Like the more time you spend anywhere, like the more things you're going to find to do. And like I can't believe how many things we found to do in Mishkoltz like that I, I, I had no idea about. And, and we came here already. Like this is really cool. Like. So, you know, we're practicing our photography. Felicia's practicing her photography. So follow her, because this has nothing to do with me. Follow her on Instagram, A Feather in the Wind. It's our Instagram. Well, it is, but I don't do nothing with it. So it's actually going to look good. Just like our videos. I don't do nothing with them, because Wes edits them. So. No, that's not true. She has, she has a lot of input. I do get a little tweak. <laughs> a little tweak here and there. <laughs> okay. But thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you we inspired you to see Mishkoltz. And Great city. a lot of what we did was possible because of the tourist card that we got. The Mishkoltz Pass mm -hmm. comes in super handy and like definitely would recommend uh, doing that because it simplifies so much and then you feel like a VIP. You just flash the card and you get all these free things. Next stop is um, Eger. Eger, Eger, Eger. Wow. I don't know. I'm not trying to. I'm not making but, fun of Hungarians. I just don't know the accent. Okay. It's Eger. Okay, we we get it. No, well. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, Edgar is like a, a. It's supposed to be like a, a really nice city. Like people go to Edgar because it's very pretty. Um, and the wine. And it's, we're gonna drink some wine. I'm really excited. Yeah, Hungarians a wine country. Geez, this was supposed to be like a 30 second outro, it's yeah, a minute and a half. We're talking too much. Okay, today. Thank adios. Thank you guys for putting Amigos. up with us. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, guys, that's the end of our video. What do you think, Felicia? <laughs> Just kidding, that's a night. She doesn't laugh at my jokes. <laughs>